I mean, you, you, you see all these different signs. The curse is a sign. The blessing is a sign. So here's another sign that we saw. Now, here is, uh, uh, now, I can't pronounce it. I feel like the name is all kind of missing there. But this is a palace in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. Now, this is, now, the original, the, the palace that all the other kings, they, they still have kingdoms in Nigeria. They have many kingdoms. Like you saw that map that Deacon showed in there, showed the kingdom of Judah. They have kingdoms. Even though Nigeria is a republic, they have kingdoms around. You can see right here, mm -hmm. that's where Nigeria sits today. The kingdom of Judah. Right there, you can see that little hump. Oh, that's where it was right there. Okay, all of that. That's And, and you know, so that's Beni, Togo. Uh, part of that all used to be Yoruba land. Mm -hmm. So down here where you see down uh, to the right and then to Beni, to Togo, all used to be Yoruba land. Go back to that old map. Go go to the bigger vision. I want to see the hump. Where's the kingdom? Where's the kingdom of uh, Judah? Okay, right there. Okay. <clears throat> so you can see where it is today. Go now. Turn around. So you have a lot of Yoruba. So obviously you could be in Nigeria, Beni, Togo, and still be Yoruba. So, but most of the Yoruba people are in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. But a lot of uh, like, there's Yoruba in Togo, Beni. But a lot, but the majority of the Yorubas are in Nigeria. But there's still there's also uh, Yorubas, especially on the um, near the uh, the coast here. So anyway, um, it, it's just blowing. So they still have kingdoms. Let me read this uh, significant thing here to you guys. It says here, during the transatlantic, let's see if I got this. During the transatlantic slave trade, countless of ships transported millions of Africans. Right. From the west coast of Africa between 1441 and 1840, the overwhelming majority of these slaves were Yoruba and Igbos, or Igbo. Many of the slaves were kidnapped directly from Portuguese and or captured during the inter-village wars. Capture was made easier due to the loose, autonomous nature of the villages and kingdoms. The, this autonomy, this autonomy of how they do government out there is still slightly in place within the Yoruba people and is evident in the system of prince and kings that still exist in many towns till to this day. I did, We just showed you a picture of me and um, TJ, brother TJ, was literally at a, a king's palace. Mm -hmm. that's where you, if you, when you come into town, that's where you go greet the king. Now, th when we went there that day, uh, he wasn't there, but listen to this to show that picture of the uh, uh, of that picture where we were standing in front of the uh, palace there. While he's doing that, I'm gonna read this. Undali, we have sometime heard. Listen to this. Undali, we have all all as sometime heard stories and made jokes about Nigerian prince coming to America. Is kind of like that joke, right? Nigerian prince probably asked every Nigerian we came across if they were a prince. It is interesting to know that the ancient Israelites were first known to have 12 and countless of princes as well, especially during the days of what? Solomon. Solomon had a lot of wives and a lot of concubines. Can you imagine how many princes came from him? It says Solomon had many wives and normal concubines. You see this in Numbers uh, chapter 1, verse 44, Judges in chapter 5. First Kings 11. At one point, the Israelite prince were 232 in numbers. In numbers. Let me just go here. I just want to go to this one verse here because it would be real quick. Let me go here. First Kings. I mean, and, and the reason why I want to bring this up, there's a significant here I want to uh, bring up here. First King chapter 20, verse 15. So you guys can see, I mean, is when you read this stuff, it says, I'll go here. Read that uh, 14 and 15, Deacon. <clears throat> and Ahab said, by whom? And he said, thus saith the, the Lord, even by the young men of the princes of the provinces. Then he said, who shall order the battle? And he answered, thou. Then he numbered the young men of the princes of the providence, and they were 232 
And after them he numbered all the people, even all the children of Israel, being thousand, seven thousand. Yeah, Israel. And then being, yeah, so there was 232. Is that what it says right there? Yeah, 232. Go back to that picture. Now, listen, look at this. If you look at this picture here, to the very far right next, that's the woman that showed us her land. Mm -hmm. um, I can't think of her name right now. Nice sister. Uh, she showed us, and, and, and if you notice, her head is covered. That is normal practice, right? Did you notice that, TJ? Mm -hmm. That is a mm -hmm. normal practice for a lot of women to cover their head like this. Yeah. But she is a Muslim. She is a Muslim woman. But she showed us her land, beautiful land. But next to her, this is who we call uncle. Bro, I this when I was a little boy, he he moved in. My dad allowed him to uh, stay with us. I mean, like we was doing community. So I was I was growing up in the community, didn't even know it, right? We have all these people that come from Nigeria and seem like they stop at our place. They lived there for like two or three or four or five years. So that was my uncle right there. So I always called him uncle. It wasn't until this day. Listen to the TJ. I'm 40 something years old. And I found out that my uncle, well, he's not my uncle, but the man, he's a prince. Yeah, yep. He's a prince. I remember that one. Of his kingdom. <laughs> That's I'm his like, ah, ah, hey, <laughs> uncle, you are a prince. <laughs> like a That's real live prince. There was. And no, and, and, he, and he never told us that. He said, I never told you, but he's a prince. He's in line to be king. If he wanted to, he's in line to be king of this kingdom here. Now, this yeah. is a small kingdom in the village here, but Still. everything started from Ife, the one that we wanted to go check. Remember the one we, we couldn't check out because of, we were trying to get mm -hmm. to the Sabbath? That's where all the other kingdoms came from is from that kingdom that we did okay. see. Yeah. And but the only reason why we did detoured because we had to move uh, go to this state to get back, we didn't want to miss the Shabbat 